1. Fill in the blanks with appropriate answers. 1. Division of labor leads to organic merger of various sections. 2. Landless laborer are called as unorganized laborers. 3. Laborers of medical institutions are called as organized laborers. 2. Answer the following in a sentence. 1. What is division of labor? Answer. Division of labor means work being done by people depending on their interests, tastes, abilities, age, expertise, skills and gender. 2. Answer the following in a sentence. 2. What is labor with payment? Answer, the labor which gets compensation based on hours, days or months for semi-skilled or skilled work is considered as labor with pay. 3. What is labor without payment? Answer, if work is done without payment either in cash or kind, it is called as labor without pay. 4. What is organized labor sector? Answer, the sector which is enrolled as per the law of the government, and provided fixed wages, facilities within the framework of law is called organized sector. It is guided by Minimum Wages Act, Factory Act, Special Allowance Act, Provident Fund Act and many other acts in support of laborers. Answer, the sector which is enrolled as per the law of the government, and provided fixed wages, facilities within the framework of law is called organized sector. It is guided by Minimum Wages Act, Factory Act. Special Allowance Act, Provident Fund Act and many other acts in support of laborers. 5. What is unorganized labor sector? Answer. The unorganized labor sector is that where legal provisions do not completely govern. The relationship between the employer and employee is not guided by any legal provisions. Answer. The unorganized labor sector is that where legal provisions do not completely govern. The relationship between the employer and employee is not guided by any legal provisions. Answer. The unorganized labor sector is that where legal provisions do not completely govern. The relationship between the employer and employee is not guided by any legal provisions. 6. What are the challenges faced by unorganized sectors workers? Answer, laborers working in unorganized sectors do not have fixed work schedule, fixed pay or defined benefits. They don't get fixed wage too. Answer, laborers working in unorganized sectors do not have fixed work schedule, fixed pay or defined benefits. They don't get fixed wage too. Answer, Laborers working in unorganized sectors do not have fixed work schedule, fixed pay or defined benefits. They don't get fixed wage too. 3. Discuss in group and answer the following. 1. What are the types of organized labor? Explain. Answer. The types of organized laborers are working in institutions like school, hospital, industries government related services commercial banks life insurance companies military and others answer the types of organized laborers are working in institutions like school hospital industries government related services commercial banks life insurance companies military and others 2 define discrimination in labor answer any labor that goes against victim equal labor equal pay can be termed inequality in labor. Answer. Any labor that goes against victim equal labor equal pay can be termed inequality in labor. If differential payment is given for two people who put the same amount of time and efforts, then it is called as discrimination. Though women and men engage similar work. Their compensation is not the same. In India men are paid more for their work than women. 3. 
explain the challenges faced on social security issue by the unorganized sectors. Answer. The challenges faced on social security issue by the unorganized sectors are Migration Laborers of migrate from one place to another place in search of work and have no social security. Social security, the minimum needs like health, water, food, drinking water, equal opportunity to work, etc. is not available for laborers. Legal Framework Many legal provisions like receiving wages as per their work duration, provident fund, etc. are not given. Child labor, children work in unhealthy and dangerous environment on many semi-skilled or unskilled works. Their sectors foster child labor. 4. What are the differences between organized and unorganized workers? Answer. The difference between organized and unorganized workers is as follows. Organized workers, the sector is enrolled as per the law of the government. Laborers are paid fixed wages and the facilities are given within the framework of law. The sector is guided by Minimum Wages Act, Factory Act, Special Allowances Act, Provident Fund Act and may other acts in support of laborers. The laborers are provided employment security. They are paid on specified dates along with overtime pay whenever the workers have worked more. Unorganized workers, in this sector, the legal provisions do not completely govern. There is no fixed wage. The laborers work for wages. The minimum wages in this sector usually stays below the mandatory pay fixed by the governments. The workers do not receive any medical benefit or overtime benefit, they do not get any paid leaves. The relationship between the employer and the employee is not guided by any legal provisions. Laborers work in construction sites, loading and unloading, etc.